Um, okay, Anna says, I'm on my third round of interviews for a new job. So this is a little bit, uh, this is work, this is job search related. Um, cause a lot of you guys are running, are still in your day jobs and running business on the side. I know Anna's one of them. So big shout out to you guys who are making it all happen. Um, okay. So I'm going to read her question. Um, I'm on my third round of interviews for a new job. I have a coffee meeting with one of the VPs tomorrow. I've done a phone interview with her before, so I think this is more casual. Um, twice it's happened that this lady has sent me an email at 11 p.m. at night. Is it okay during the interview tomorrow to ask about the work culture and to ask if she has just if she is just a night owl or if she is sending emails at 11 because they have no work-life balance? Or do I wait for the job offer to ask them? Okay, so here's what I would do, Anna. I would try to make like a casual comment about it while you're at, co at coffee or like a joke or something. Like um, if there's a way to like bring up coffee and be like, oh, do you, you probably need it. Like you were up late last night or, you know, I noticed you were up late. Like maybe her like clock settings are off or something. Or maybe I have heard this happen that some people will like wait and send all their emails at like one time a day or something and it's like all pre-scheduled in their email system or who knows maybe she wants people to think that she's working late or something um, but I think it's totally fine to ask the question um, <clears throat> at the at the meeting like even something like um, you could say would I be required to work late um, as well or um, would I be, you know, required to answer emails at 11 like you are, or, you know, maybe there's a way to like talk about when you work best. Like for me, I would be like, I would try and get the conversation to go to a place where I say like, I'm a morning person, you know, I love my time in the mornings and, um, you know, like, uh, I need my sleep. Like we've had, so this is a great example, um, Natalie. Uh, Natalie is our social media uh, partnerships coordinator and she, we were going to have a meeting after my daughter went to sleep. Um, we were going to schedule our weekly meetings, team meetings at 8.30 p.m. Or I think it was like 7.30 p.m. Pacific, which she was on the East Coast. So it was like, you know, it was going to be like 9.30, uh, 10 her time. And I just threw it out there because who knows, maybe someone on the team is fine with a 10 o'clock meeting. I'll just throw it out there because I wanted my daughter uh, to be asleep when we had our meetings. And she just wrote back right away and she said, no, nope, that's like, I, I will be sleeping at that time. Um, so I think that's important to know, like just to, and, and it, it didn't impact me at all. Like I knew I was totally okay with it. And we ch actually changed the meetings to earlier. Um, so now my daughter comes in and uh, hangs out during our meetings sometimes, but that's okay. Um, so I wouldn't be too worried about 11 p.m. is crazy. I mean, that's just crazy, especially if you're worried that they're going to be making you work late at night. So that would be, I would try my best, like see how it goes, see how your rapport is at the meeting. Um, I would try and just like fit it in a little bit, but not make her like feel bad. So there's, there's two options. So either I would like I just said, like kind of bring it up in like a casual, fun, coffee um, sort of way that you notice she was up late or something, or you got your e got the email late or something. Or um, I would just flat out ask, like, you know, um, would I be required to work um, late nights as well? You know, I'm a morning person. I'm just wondering like would I be required to this because it could just be a time management issue goodness I had a client back in the day at my old consulting job she, I would get to work on Monday and she had sent like 10 emails on Sunday like she would she was so terrible at managing her time during the week that she had to work all weekend and it was a reflection on her. I mean, we all knew she was terrible at time management. And so the only time she could focus was when she got home. And then, you know, poor lady, she had kids and a husband and everything, but she was still sending us emails like all weekend. Um, and it was just, it looked poorly on her because it looked like she had a bad productivity and time management. So maybe that's what's going on, on there. Um, but yeah, I think it's totally fine to ask, especially if it's just a casual coffee meeting. 